Hey guys, JK47 here, and welcome to a, new, a video on my channel. Um, today I'm going to be trying to, well today I'm just going to be trying to like work out or try and pitch together all the ideas and all the little tips and stuff that we've got off Call of Duty and try and work out what um, what Call of Duty 2016 is going to be. Now if you've, we're just going to get straight into it, so if you've um, not been, oh, if you've not been following uh, Call of Duty, then um then you'll know that uh sledgehammer treyarch and infinite well infinity ward are working on a, a three year development cycle and this year it is um infinity ward's turn to make a game and we're putting together all the facts and stuff that um that they've shown us all the facts we found out and try and work out um what exactly it is going to be this year so um the first facts that we've got is that um well the first games, if you didn't know, that like Infinity Ward have made. Infinity Ward made. Well, no. Infinity Ward wait. Infinity Ward made. Infinity Ward made the original Call of Duty, Call of Duty 2, Modern Warfare, the trilogy, Modern Warfare 1, Modern Warfare 2, Modern Warfare 3, and Ghosts. Now, you may not know them from, um, like, Modern Warfare, the trilogy, but if you're quite new to Call of Duty, but you will definitely probably have known them from Ghosts. And there was a lot of mixed feedback from Ghosts, and that's probably why you know them as well. Wow, that's my first kill. Um, what am I doing? Why am I not playing the objective also? Um, yeah, so they're made their free games, and I'm here to talk to you about what I think the next game might be. So, um, this year, it was, um, well, last year, it was Call of Duty Black Ops 3, which was Treyarch's game, and... Ooh. Quick! Wow, I'm getting really distracted um, by this. So, if we look at what I think it's going to be, basically, is I think it's going to be a new Call of Duty this year, and I'm going to tell, right, walk you through the steps of why I think this. So, if we look at the top five games, or like Call of Duty bestsellers, then um, it will be Modern Warfare 3 was the top one, Infin uh, by Infinity Ward. Also, um. Uh, sledgehammer games helped them make that. Um, number two is Black Ops the original by Treyarch. Um, number three is Modern Warfare 2 by Infinity Ward again. Number four is Black Ops 2 by Treyarch and number four, uh, number five sorry is the original Modern Warfare by Infinity Ward. So out of the top five, um, three of them are made by Infinity Ward. So I really think that it's going to be a good game. Um, another thing is that Advanced Warfare, made by Sledgehammer Games, they brought us um, boosts, like they brought us exosuits and boost packs and stuff like that, which changed the um, it changed like the way that we move around the map with more fluidity, and it made the maps kind of more vertical, more upwards. Whereas um, Black Ops 3, Treyarch brought us wall running and thrust jumps, which completely changed the movement system and made it so people could move like fluidly and dynamically around the map also. Infinity Ward are the only three out of the trilogy, oh well, out of the uh, three game developers that haven't really added any movement systems. So that could be another factor that may be adding like a new movement fix, well, a, a new movement feature to the game. Um, Call of Duty Ghost 2 um, has an ending that pretty much, I don't know why I paused there, has an ending that pretty much says, yeah, there's going to be a new Call of Duty Ghosts. But after the mixed feedback that they got, I don't think there actually is a high chance of getting a new Ghost. When people are saying that they're going to, um, when they're going to remaster a Call of Duty, I think this is pretty unlikely too. Because um, I think this is the first time they've had three years to develop a game. Um, I really, well, I really don't think that they would have wanted to waste that three years. Just like redeveloping remastering a game that they've already made i think they wanted to spend their three years wisely i think they would have wanted to get new um get new like a new storyline and stuff like that i think that's what they would have wanted to do anyway so um i think it's going to be a new call of duty i think they would have wanted to use this three years that they've had to create a new title modern warfare 3 as in the list um modern warfare 3 was the highest the most bestseller and i think this was actually because um i think this was because it ended in a trilogy i think it ended in a trilogy it was a good idea to end it in a trilogy 
and I don't see anything wrong with ending it in a trilogy. I think Modern Warfare 4 will just kind of bring it one game too far than what it needed to be. I think Black Ops 3 is definitely going to end as a trilogy. I don't think it needs any more games. I think it's going to do very well as a trilogy. And I don't think it needs to have any games. I think a few of my friends at school have asked and they've said, oh, I think it's going to be Modern Warfare 4. But it's kind of a group kind of a group kind of mutual feeling that everyone really wants to be feet on the ground. Um, so yeah, that's really all I have to say about this topic. Finally, I think that, um, it, well, I hope that Infinity Ward have listened to the fans. I really hope they've been um, reading like the uh, tweets and reading the comments on YouTube. And one of the tweets that I saw was um, someone basically saying that they just didn't want exosuits back and that was one of the most liked comments. So I think that's a pretty good reason like to have like an olden, old style game. Now, uh, I know that Tre uh, like World at War is Treyarch's game, I know that Treyarch made it, but I really don't see any reason why they can't make an, an old World War style game. I know that there was an idea for a Vietnam World War like type game, but I d it never got released, it was one of the ones that just kind of got cancelled. So um, I think there's definitely ideas for that, definitely a new COD. Um, now the only reason I'm having problems like, well not having problems, the only reason I'm having trouble believing that um, they might ha make a new COD is because I'm just thinking what, they've, Call of Duty have had so many dead ends, they've had Advanced Warfare which with the f feedback that received I don't think there's going to be a 2, I would like there to be but I just don't think it's going to happen. Ghosts, same again, I don't think there's going to be a number 2 and um, I, that's why I think it's going to be a new Call of Duty. So my theory or like suggestion is that they will like I think they're gonna find a way to tie technology into the game, um, and with that technology in the campaign, create like a time machine or something, and have the main playable characters go through it. So basically, I want the game to be set in the past. Um, most people really do want their feet firmly on the ground in this game, and I think I'm one of them. I do like. I didn't like it in Advanced Warfare. That was very much t too technology. I kind of like. Look, if I boost over this now, it's not too much of a boost. It's kind of just jet boosts, and I kind of like that. What are you doing, mate? Um. So yeah, I think it's gonna be kind of an old game. Infinity Ward. I'm gonna probably make this old types game. Where's this person? Why am I talking about where's this person? You guys didn't come here to listen to this. To listen to this. Listen to this. Um, yeah, so I think with this time machine type idea, I think it'll be a good stable base. Maybe you'll be able to tie in some of the more technological games, um, like Advanced Warfare and Black Ops 3. And, um, I think this is pretty much my kind of theory, my kind of guess to what 20 Call of Duty 2016 will be. If you, um, had any other ideas, uh, leave them down in the comments section. What is this? And why also, why can I not kill them? Um, but yeah, this is all just based on a hunch, it's all based on a, like an idea, so if this year Call of Duty Ghost 2 comes out, then God help us all.